When you make use of Electron, you most likely want to make use of it not only because it supports JavaScript and you can rely on the technologies that you already know, but also because it offers a multi-platform support out of the box. So the Electron app can run on Mac, Linux, and Windows. But as I said, the current Electron build command is only going to build for the operating system that you are currently on. To fix this, this is a common uh, set of scripts that I use in my apps. So here they are. We have build OS X, build win, build Linux, and build all. So as you can see, what we're doing is with OS X, I'm just using the default Electron build command because I am on a Mac. For Windows, we are defining that we want to have a Windows build, and this Windows build will be for 64-bit systems as well as 32-bit systems. You can, of course, skip this if you don't want to support uh, older computers. Then we have Linux. So here we just define Linux. And then we have build all, which basically just reuses these commands and runs all of them. The dash P attribute that we pass here, or the dash P option, is being used for the update mechanism that we'll cover later. So with this, when you want to, for example, create a Windows build, all you need to do is run yarn build colon win, and this is going to maybe install additional dependencies. So wine, for example, is a dependency that could be needed for you to build a Windows application. Here we can see now Electron is being downloaded for the Windows version, and afterwards the Windows app is going to be built. All right, and now if we take a look at the dist folder, then we can see that we have a couple more files in here. So now we have the executable for Windows as well as the block map file. And then we have those unpacked um, folders for Windows as well. So for Windows, you basically end up having an installer that you can then install what is in here. So yeah, like this with these uh, scripts, that's what I use to build other operating systems or build all of them at once from my computer.